Hello and welcome back. Interestingly to me, the video so far that I posted with the most views is the thrifting video, so here goes another one. Now, since the previous video was posted, this has been a, probably a few weeks, but I got a Cyclonic and a Champion both by Busby for, I think, about $6 total because one of them was 25% off or something. I don't know. These were not much money. I've already modded the Cyclonic in a separate video that you can look for if you're curious. And uh, honestly, the Champion is pretty awesome stock as far as stock blasters go. And this orange piece at the front makes it kind of hard to mod. So we'll see. I'll probably leave that as it is for now. Now, any given week, I pretty much go to probably two or three thrift stores on the weekend while I'm grocery shopping. And uh, I did that today as usual. And let's go to some clips that show just how well I did. Another Saturday, another thrift shop run. Now, without getting into too much information about where I live and what my favorite shops are, if you know where I live because you saw this on Facebook or something, then you may be able to guess what the shop is, but we'll see if I have any luck today. So even though that is basically my favorite place to thrift for Nerf stuff, um, and I mean they had something of a selection, but I didn't buy anything. Um, actually the thing I came closest to buying was a $5 Voltron Lion, but without the other four, limited benefit. Next I'm going to stop in one of the many City Goodwills. Now unlike some of those videos you see, these Goodwills just do not have much of a toy selection. The place I was just in is not a Goodwill. This is actually a pretty big Goodwill in terms of clothing and stuff, but they just do not get much in the way of toys. I don't know if that's because of just people don't donate them, or the turnaround is so fast because it is in the city that people buy them so fast, but I mean, look at this. There's, there's not even a Maverick. As you can see, that was not very good thrifting. Um, I didn't buy, I didn't buy anything today. However, about a week ago, I was at the local Goodwill outlet now. For whatever reason, I tend to actually have better luck at the Goodwill outlet than I do at the regular Goodwill. I, I've never, I've never bought a Nerf Blaster at a regular Goodwill store. I almost never see them. I don't know what it is with my area, but at the outlet, sometimes I have amazing finds. So here we go. I got a rough cut, and this Rebel Dark Holder was on a one of the bows, and I put it on here because, you know, dark holder. So a rough cut, this thing seems to work okay, even though it's incredibly sun faded. That's not just camera um, artifacting, it is, it looks, it looks awful, but you know what, it's functional. I got two Zingbo arrows. Yeah, I mean, why not? They, they are so light as to be almost nothing. I got a roll of painter's tape because why not? I got a sharp fire. I've never owned a sharp fire before. A lot of people seem to like it, and I don't know. It's, it seems okay, and it seems to work. It's not the most comfortable thing in my hand because of this, the way the butt butts into your hand. I got two rival rounds be, because they're essentially free. You know, you pay by the weight. And the piece de resistance. I got a blue stripe, dude. I looked all over, I could not find the battery door, but a blue strife. How awesome is that? I don't know if it actually works because, I mean, you know, for the most part, we're gonna mod these things, and even if, even if the stock internals did not work, I have other stock internals that I could replace them with, but a blue strife, dude. And, how much did I pay for all this? Well, I was at the outlet. I paid $3.91 for all of this crap. Isn't that awesome? All right, well. Let me tell you, I probably only have that good of luck at the outlet, maybe 1 in 20 times if I'm lucky. I normally go there, look around, don't find anything, but this was striking it rich. 
I think I've only had good luck, genuinely good luck at the Goodwill Outlet twice before. And that was before I started making YouTube videos, so you're not going to see those hauls. But, uh, yeah, pretty awesome. Alright, take care. Thanks for watching.